First job out of drama school, it was a massive break for me. I get picked up by the second AD and Deb is in the front seat of the car. She had sunglasses on, I don't forget, she took off her seatbelt and she turned around on the front seat with her knees on the front seat and put out her hand and took off her sunglasses and said, hi, I'm Deborah Lee Finesse, nice to meet you. And I remember thinking, I like this girl. She was obviously very, very beautiful and all that, but just the way she broke down any barrier, of forget star and all that, everyone loved Deb and she's a formidable actress. He said, oh, I've got a crush on you. I went, oh, I said, oh, I've got a crush on you too. And that's like then we admitted it. Uh, enjoy the snow, everyone, and... Uh, stay warm, stay safe. My family and Deb have sacrificed. And I've turned down stuff because I thought I'd sell too much. Uh, there's been times, I remember when I did Les Mis, Deb was like, look, this is going to be difficult, but you've got to do that part. Our priority is our family, and we, we're there for each other. And Like, even at the Oscars, I walk out, I put my hand on my heart, and I always look to Deb in the audience. And it's just this reminder to me. And straight afterwards, I will not see anybody in my dressing room until Deb's been in because that is the foundation of our family and therefore my life. Everything else is this kind of what happens about on the surface but underneath the surface where it's real, where it's still and where it's deep, that is the love I have with Deb.